Alright, that's my last delivery. Unfortunately, Rob has been injured again. He's at the hospital now. Apparently, they had to take him somewhere else, like fly him to another place. It's crazy. At least I got this new job being a pizza delivery driver. That's pretty much the only positive thing about recently. But wait a second. Today's the day he's supposed to come back. Yeah, they flew him out, these weird people, and um, hopefully I'll get him back. Uh, I think the, yeah, the airport's that way, okay. Just need to find a way out there. Um, anyways, I'll, head, I'll start heading towards the airport, and yeah, I'll see you guys once I get there. Okay, and it's a long overdue one as well. So, um, yeah, anyways, we're gonna go see Rob here, as long as the train doesn't come and hit us. Actually, where is the train? I haven't seen it today. Anyways, yeah, uh, wow, it is dark out. But yeah, anyways, we're gonna go see, we're gonna go pick up Rob. Um, yeah. I just realized this in the middle of the night. I hope, uh, whoa, is that a bump? I don't know, it's hard to see the roads around here, especially now, because it's nighttime. Alright, so we're about to pull up here. I hope it's not too late. Um, who are these guys? That's a big truck. Hello, um, can I go in? I'm here to pick up Rob. <laughs> what do you mean? But I need to pick up Rob. <laughs> what, what do you mean? Why, why can't I go in to go get him? <laughs> okay, you're the police then? Uh, can I see your badge number, please? <laughs> All right, fine then. I'll, uh, I guess I'll just leave you guys alone. Um, can I pick him up tomorrow then? Huh. Okay. Uh, send this mail. All right. Um, yep. See you later then, I guess. That was weird. Something seems fishy about those men. Or that guy, I guess. I'm assuming there are other people in those cars. Oh, well, that's not important. So, they said they were over the police, but they didn't... Oh, there's the train. They didn't send me a... They didn't give me a badge number or anything. I think that... I think they're like... Uh, I think we need to sneak by them tomorrow. Am I even on the road? Yes, I am. Yeah. More or less. Oh, well. Anyways, yeah, let's head back home, and uh, hopefully I'll be able to um, pick up a whoa. Um. Okay. Yeah. Hopefully this is just as easy to be repaired as the van. Man, I can't believe it. All right, we're almost home now. My car's destroyed, so if you're wondering why we're gonna be driving this pretty much all episode, yeah, I can't afford to get it in a mechanic. And you wanna know why, guys? I'm a million dollars in debt. Most of it's because they actually figured out how to catch up to me, but, you know, oh well. Anyways, hopefully we'll be able to head out tomorrow morning and pick up Rob. Hope that's gonna be the case. Um, yeah, but let me show you. Remember, in um, the last episode, uh, we Rob rammed my car into this, and not only did it break my headlight, it uh, exploded the wall and a bit of the car, and I cannot afford to get it to a mechanic, um, so I've got the work car, which I luckily can take home. Anyways, let's go in here and um, head to sleep. Hopefully, we'll be able to pick up Rob tomorrow. Hope nothing bad's happened. Oh, whoa, 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 Are those sirens? They sound like ambulance sirens. They sound like they're over there. That's the direction of the airport. Hope nothing bad's happened to Rob. I gotta go check. <sighs> um... I hope that's not for Rob. 
I mean, I kind of do, actually, because then I'm, they might let me in. If they know I'm part of Rob's family, I guess. Anyways, oh, I have to manually shift this car. Whoa, okay. Uh, yeah, anyways, I'll see you guys once I get to the airport. Alright guys, I'm back. So, um, we're almost at the airport now. I think, yeah, it's the town up there, so this should be the airport. Uh, I don't see those weird men in black vehicles, so, um, hopefully that's a good thing. So now we just have to, um, now I just have to get in there and, I think that's the ambulance. It's on the runway. So that must be bad. Oh my gosh. I don't even have signs anymore, though. Whoa, 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 whoa! Who leaves a bunch of rubbish on the road? I just popped my tire. I didn't get that. Oh well, it's more important is to make sure that that's not Rob. Oh my gosh, that sun is blinding. Hello? <gasps> is that Rob? <laughs> Rob's favorite spot on the couch, and now he's dead. <laughs> we have a field here, too. And water. Better get my suit. <laughs> was wasn't an accident. So I've got this gun on me now. And this will be my self-protection. I even spent the money fixing getting my car fixed. Oh well. I should drive to the funeral. A desert Worms base. So we have to get there without letting them. We're gonna have to pretend to be one of them. We cannot, I do not want to die either. So this is gonna be my way to get around it. Okay guys? So we have to 
Well, we're already wearing a suit, so I guess we're gonna have to keep wearing this suit. Um, I bet you it's it was those guys who wouldn't let me in because they were busy staging this fake accident from the plane. So what we have to do is impersonate them. Now we saw that they had a bunch of blacked out cars, and I don't have a blacked out version, of them, and I can't, I don't want to paint this black because this is my car and I don't want it black. I like it as it is. So we're going to have to get another car from the junkyard. So I'm going to park this at home and then we're going to go run to the junkyard. Luckily home's right there, right next to the junkyard, so this won't be too hard. Man, you know, it kind of feels good that Rob's alive, but it do kind of doesn't at the same time because he's, he was, he's being captured by these people. I wonder why they did this. Why would anyone do this? Let's go. So we have to, we, ha we are armed with this gun. So let's see, um, why are there no cars here? Like, I mean, I see those things, but there are no cars here. But, like, that actually looked like they would run. There has to be one here at least, right? What? Possibly be no cars at the junkyard. Oh my gosh, it was the long haul. All right, let's see. Uh, see what the uh, maybe he has some something in this garage I can um, buy from him. Manager, manager. All right, thanks. You don't know how much this means to me, manager. He landed us his. There's only one car was in this garage. In fact, someone was paying to get it fixed. So, he lended us this vehicle, temporarily, so we're going to have to drive it, and he says there are some surprises in it, so, uh, I guess we'll figure out what surprises mean later. Right now, we have to get to the desert form space, it has a GPS, I believe, somewhere in it, um, yeah, so, uh, hopefully we won't have any trouble getting there, um, but yeah, we have a spy car. Whoa! There are guns on this car. Okay, this is the perfect car for secret spy mission. In fact, this is probably something they would have. Just, um, this is probably black. Did I park my... I parked my car in the wrong... <laughs> parked my car in the wrong spot. Now, hopefully he doesn't mind. We have to go. Okay, we can't waste any time here. Moving my car. Oh, it seems like it maybe will roll across the street. Wait, may? Oh, oh, I can park it in the next one. Oh my gosh, roll all the way across the street. That's sick. Uh, we have to hurry. We have to drive as fast as we can. We have to get there as fast as possible. We have to get to the desert right now. We have to get to the canyon. Hopefully. Oh my gosh, we are going fast. We're already 133 kilometers an hour. We have to get there as fast as we possibly can. And, oh, we're gonna take a dirt road here. Oh, we're gonna jump the train tracks. All right, let's go. And, oh, we're gonna have to take a detour. Anyways, I'll see you guys once we get to the desert. We have to hurry. We've been driving the desert for a fairly long time. And we're almost to the base, but we're pretty low on gas as well. Um, unfortunately, that's not good. But, um, I think we'll still be able to make it, at least to the Desert Worms base. Or, uh, even if we don't make it, we'll probably have a... I mean, there'll be like... I'm sure there'll be a vehicle on the road we may need to take in case we run out of gas. But hopefully we don't, because this thing's pretty epic. I mean, I haven't had to use any of them. The amazing things that are on it. Can I use them? Yeah, okay. So, I haven't been able to use those things yet, but um, hopefully I'll get a chance to because it's pretty awesome. Um, yeah, so we're almost there right now, so. Um, yeah, hopefully we'll be able to make it there. We're already going pretty fast because this car is fast. Oh dear. Either way, let's uh, keep driving and keep saying either way in my videos. 
me to get out of my habit. But yeah. So supposedly there is a Desert Worms base is on the plane. I don't know. I mean, maybe that makes it more mobile, I guess. But I mean, if anything, you probably want to be driven the road. Because say your train is derailed, what are you going to do now? If your car drives off the road, you just you know, turn it back on and then you pull it out. But the train you can't really do that. And then you're loaded into the track with the car you can go off road and you really want to. So, um, the Desert Warren's base is like right on the other side of the bridge because we're heading all across the bridge and hopefully we'll be able to blend in and if not, well, shoot it. <laughs> That's essentially how it's going to work. But yeah, hopefully we can get there. Hopefully we'll be able to save Rob today. But you know, it's, it's a good thinking that he's alive. So it's, you know, it was pretty hard in the last two days when we thought he was dead. So we're probably just running on fumes right now, so not uh, the greatest. Um, I also never understood why there's literally nobody on these roads. Um, I think that might be someone up there though. I see some lights shine, so maybe there is somebody up there. Um, hmm, I don't see them right now. Oh, there are some lights up there. Maybe thinking stars. There are some people. Oh no, they're desert worms. Oh dear. Open fire! Oh no, it's not doing anything! Oh dear, oh no! Oh, the car's dead. We had a couple of them down. Do I have my gun? Oh no. Oh no, gun's in the car. Um. Oh, it still drives. That's good. Um. Uh, can I just. Oh, it can't. Or we're gonna have to back up on these people. Actually, hold on. Okay, run, 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 run. Okay, we're gonna have to run. Let's take cover behind this Hummer. And, oh, there are weapons in here. Oh my gosh, there's a uniform. Let's see if I can put it on fast. Okay, we got him on. Oh, get him! Okay, we got him. Alright, we have to... It's like they're robots or something, like, seriously. It's like they're blind or completely oblivious to my existence. Alright, we're gonna have to shoot to the head. Okay. Okay, I don't know how we haven't gotten him yet. He has to be dead. Okay, we're gonna have to get behind that. We're gonna have to get behind here. This is what they're not expecting. Okay, yeah, he's probably dead. Definitely lost a couple limbs. I mean, our point here is to kill, but like... We're engaging in fire. Okay, he has to be dead. Uh, at the very least, I've uh, knocked a lot of these guys out. He has an arm. He's lost an arm. I think we've gotten enough of them now to where it's going to be safe for me to... You know, we're going to have to take this Desert Worms Hummer. It works. Oh, if we can make it up this hill. Goodness. But oh, we're disguised as a Desert Worm now. Oh my gosh, this looks like a sandwich. Okay, this is a very slow Hummer. Or Humpy, I guess is the proper term. Okay, yeah, we have, I don't know how those guys are still standing, but, I mean, the point is, they're, I mean, I don't want to kill, oh, deer, well, we definitely kill a, a bunch of deer. Is this thing okay? Like, maybe this, I mean, this has, um, almost a full tank on it, so it should be fine. I mean, I'm, I am running over dead bodies, so that's not the greatest, but, uh, we're gonna have to go, uh, I guess we can let this to live. Oh, good. We're picking up speed now. Or, well, the car sounds like it wants to, at least. We're gonna have to move from the debris on the road. Which definitely was not my fault. Right, this appears to be a manual. Looks like we're gonna have to shift up on our own. But yeah, we're definitely picking up speed now. Alright, hopefully we'll be able to make it over there and save home. Since we're disguised as a desert war, we should be fine. Theoretically. I mean, we were just kind of... Oh, I guess it was the car. Gas that put the fire on but because the car was gray. If it was black, it probably wouldn't have. Oh, I lost it. Maybe it. Uh, I bet you I dropped it when I was getting gas.
so hopefully we'll be able to make it in there. Um, I'm not sure what my um, plan of action here is going to be. The best plan of action, since I have a gun, is probably ram. So I'm going to run into them. As many people as I can with the Hummer, because it's a Hummer. But seriously, oh, these are gas guns. Oh my gosh, where do you have to take? <laughs> Just driving across the bridge. Okay, there are definitely people here. Definitely headlights. All right, go, oh, ram. Oh my gosh. Okay, we're gonna have to get out. Of the we're gonna have to get out. We're gonna have to hurry. Run. Okay, there's the train. All right, hopefully they're not seen. They didn't see that. Well, they didn't see me get out. And we'll be able to have a nice sniper shot. I also have to see that. We're gonna have to shoot the tank. I'm assuming they're probably gonna be in that. Rob's gonna be in that SUV. All right, we've shot. We've opened fire on the tank. And in fact, it's probably the best to get the desert worms out first. This is. Oh my gosh! I just exploded them. You know what? Let's just make the train dysfunctional. All right. It seems like yeah, there are more of those men in black guys. I didn't see them. Okay, those are probably the real bad guys. In fact, they're probably holding the worms against something, so let's blow them up. Alright, All right, hopefully the desert worms realize I am friendly, and we can just walk up to them and them on a break or something. Hey guys, uh, I was just on break. What happened? Oh my gosh. Oh no, these people. These poor people. These guys. Oh no, that's horrible. They've been hit. Oh. What about that guy we have, Rob? What happened to him? Where is he? Is he in the SUV? Oh my gosh, they took him. And we're going to very sneakily drive away. There's another note in this car. Oh dear, I've got stuck. There's another note in this car. Note though, so the note says, Nice try, Bob, but you won't get away with it that easily. Now you actually have to turn yourself in at the old city. The old city. Oh, the old city. Well, oh, because we're gonna have to go find another car. Yeah. I thought we had them. I guess he predicted that we were gonna go in there, guns a blazing. Okay, maybe next time we can't do that again. But at least he's not dead. That's the only thing about this. Oh my goodness, I've been running for like forever. Man, is that a, finally a gas station? No, oh, there's a rusty 1955 Chevy Bel Air. But that doesn't. Yeah, that looks like a part just fell out. Wait, I really need a car, and this looks like it's packed for a road trip. I mean, oh, that's got a spare tire in it and everything. And, I mean, it's clearly a jalopy, but still. Uh, okay, let's... Uh, uh this is the Desert Worm, so uh, I'm gonna need to commandeer this vehicle. Um... Uncle Lutfi? Uh, where, where is everyone? Uh, probably out back. Well, probably buying parts of sorts. Uh, well, let's close the trunk and uh, close the passenger door. And, uh, oh, yeah, can't drive with the hood up. Well, maybe we can. We'll see. Oh, boy, this doesn't look like it fit there very really well. I can't believe I did that. Well, it isn't exactly the greatest of views, but I can most certainly do it. So, uh, yeah, I guess that's what we're going to end up doing. So, let's go! And, uh, so we were supposed to, uh, go to the old city, so, uh, I guess let's head there in this new jalopy. Wow, this thing's got some pep to it, doesn't it? Considering it is a, uh, I think this is a Leica 601 Deluxe. Um, uh, maybe it's a Leica Trabant? I think Leica's the brand. Oh my goodness, well, I guess we're gonna tumble our way to the old city, aren't we? Wee -hee -hee! Uh, I think I can get the car there in one piece. Yeah, I'll flip it over. Yeah, we'll be fine. There we are. Okay. 
Would you look at that? Alright, well, luckily it's Lego. Anything Lego is easy to put back together. Uh, we'll close the hood now, but we don't want to ruin the engine. Yeah, okay, we'll close the door too. Oh, there's the roof! Anyway, so yeah, let's uh, start heading towards the city. Wow, this thing's even an off-roader. Pretty good. Alright, anyways, it's time to head towards the city. Well, this has been quite the long drive from uh, the canyon. Hopefully I can be able to uh, save Rob and uh, actually gather some, look we'll at maybe some military backup. That would be nice. Because if I can do that, then maybe I'll be able to actually save Rob from the desert worms and uh, this uh, men in bricks fella. You know, for some reason, something's tell telling me he's a chicken. I don't know why. He just seems like he'd be the type of person to be a chicken. Anyways, so there appears to be military barracks. So that's good. I'm going to pull up right here. And we're going to say hello. Maybe get these guys to help me. That would be great. I'll, I'll even show them the letter that uh, that Men in Bricks guy wrote to me. Goodness, this thing's got slow brakes. I mean, I guess it is a jalopy, isn't it? Uh, Mr. Dob, Brick Rigs Armed Forces Dob. Y yes, salute, sir. Hello. Um, so we've got a very pressing issue that I need to talk to you and not the uh, Brick Rigs Police Department. Um, and uh, there's a note in the trunk of the uh, jalopy here. Uh, hold on. There it is, along with this wheel. Uh, here it is. So this is the note that I was written to. Basically, some guy has kidnapped Rob and uh, all that good stuff, and I need help because uh, Rob's been kidnapped, and uh, yeah, I, I'm not a police officer, I'm not a military person, whatever that's called, and uh, you are. So, can you help me? That's great, thank you. So, um, do you know where they are? Oh, well, well that saves some time, doesn't it? Um, so, can I help with, can I help you guys? Well, that's great. I'm going to go put on a military uniform. And, uh, that will be grand. Okay, probably in this locker here. Oh, yeah, that's definitely a military uniform. I got a nice, cool minigun. Whoopsies. And, uh, now I guess we can, uh, get started with this police vehicle, or... I think that's what this is. Is this just someone's car, or is it a... It's an unmarked vehicle, correct? Excellent. So when do we uh, move in? Uh, tonight? Excellent. Well, I guess I'll be waiting in the barracks until tonight. So, see you guys, and hopefully we can get Rob back. So, it's finally time I get to drive this unmarked vehicle. It's real cool. And it's even got uh, lights. I'll show you this while we're slightly far away. And, uh, it's got a police siren, too. So it's very, very cool indeed. And, uh, I'm uh, doing a little bit of Tokyo drifting here. At least, brick rigs drifting, I guess. We aren't really in Tokyo. And holy smokes is my car. I think I just popped something. Yeah, I'm definitely breaking something on this vehicle. Basically, I just destroyed it. Okay, I'm gonna turn on my police lights and stuff. Okay, I'm gonna have to run. Oh, wrong way. There we are. Okay, let's run at it. Um, what am I running at, though? No? Oh, I see some headlights. Um, is this... There's nobody in this vehicle. Yeah! Oh, this is depressing. Jeez. Basically, I'm a bad driver. Oh, I think he's getting away. He's getting away! Goodness, I think I've lost track of them. Uh, oh goodness, I'm gonna have to get the desert worms! Oh, I hear something. There he is! Okay, the car's stuck. I don't know what's going on. Okay, I think he got away, unfortunately. Um... But luckily, um, I think 
I've got an idea on where he might be headed. Or at least I can find a way to get that idea. Well, I'm getting quite handy with this thing. I mean, I guess I have used it a lot. Let's see. Oh, what's this? Is this a... Oh my gosh, this is a receipt for a Brick Riggs rocket ship. Where could he launch a rocket ship? <gasps> the airport! Okay, I'm gonna have to radio in my military friends that we're gonna head to the airport immediately. Guess I'm driving another desert Humvee. Alright, so we gotta go to the airport immediately. Well, that was quite the trip. And now I've stolen a Desert Worms Humvee, I believe that's called, which gets horrible gas mileage, but I believe I said that yesterday. So, um... Anyways, um, yeah, basically we've got to go across, and I'm, uh, I haven't quite radioed him yet, I probably should do that, so, um, yeah, um, hello, this is temporary military person, uh, Bob here, and uh, he would like some, uh, some backup at the airport, he has gained some knowledge that, yeah, the chicken man is, uh, flying into outer space, potentially, and, uh, so I'm running at the airport immediately to go and explode a rocket ship, it seems, but, uh, yeah, anyways, oh my lag, there we are, oh, we basically the whole Humvee's falling apart, well, let's not run into these fuel tanks, let's not repeat what happened to poor old man Jerry. Seems like his house got closed. Maybe old man Jerry is secretly the chicken and he never died from that fight. Well, yeah, we weren't supposed to talk about that. Um, okay. I can see him now. Okay, should I start shooting? I, I think I'm too far away to start, start shooting right now. I've got, oh my, I feel like I'm getting shot at. Oh no, I'm opening fire, opening fire. Okay, where is Chicken Man? I don't see him. But maybe I sh maybe if I get in this, I'll see him. It just takes a very long reload process. Okay, I see some dark figure running across the airport. <laughs> okay, I hope that it's still got more, more rockets left in it. Wow, this is um, quite the machine here. I'm coming for you, chicken man. I'm gonna kill you. Where is Rob? And where are you? That would be helpful. Um... Oh, blast. I think I lost him. How did I lose him? He was running! I hope he doesn't get into the rocket ship. He might be headed for the rocket ship. He might be going into outer space right now! Oh goodness, I'll have to catch up if he's not already there. Is that... That might be a running figure, I have no clue. I can't see him. Oh my gosh, I got my tire shot! Who shot me? And if so, where? Oh well, time to blow up this rocket ship once and for all!
can't shoot a rocket down and blast it. At least not with this. Maybe a military thing. Oh wait, do I have a bazooka? Oh, blast, I don't. I left my potato launcher in the desert. Blast it. Well, I left quite a mess, didn't I? And now I've got to go into outer space after this chicken man and grab Rob. Oh my, explosion. All right then, so I've managed to make it to this wonderful space station. I have no clue how he managed to get this up here. Anyways, let's use the magic of teleportation to get down into it. Um, yeah, here we are. Okay, so I've got uh, the sniper rifle. Don't know what I'm going to need that for. But, um, <gasps> that sounded close. Like, too close. <gasps> oh! <gasps> Rob! Well, I finally got this guy. I mean, yeah, that looks a little brutal, but I finally got Rob! I found him! I'm a genius! Okay, uh, Rob, we need to go. I mean, like, preferably we should go down to Earth and such. And, uh, yeah, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, and, uh, hopefully he doesn't have reinforcements. He probably does. He's probably got some desert worms up here. So let's go, Rob! Get off your... Your, your Lego feet and let's go Alright, I think that's where we need to go I think that's where our shuttle's been stationed Inside of that floating garage there And, uh, what is that thing? Uh, anyways, uh, so Rob, are you ready? We can finally go home And, you know, I mean Home-ish, Brick Rigs We still miss Scrap Mechanic But, you know, Brick Rigs will do for now um, So, let's go uh, down to Brick Rigs So, somehow we've got to make it from the space station All the way over there um, So, uh, yeah Anyways, uh, well, I hope this thing doesn't explode I mean, that would be ridiculous Actually, let's not jinx it Okay, Rob So, um, I guess we can start flying So, ready? Let's go Oh my goodness, I'm floating ridiculously slow. Oh my lag. Whoa! 